I'll tell you what, guys. I like the feeling of boost creeping up. I really do. But uh, the feeling you get when that 100 horsepower or whatever you've got it jetted for just smacks you in the ass and the tires breaks loose, there ain't nothing like it, man. There is nothing like it. All right, guys, welcome back to Bad Luck Garage. I'm on my way to English Mountain Dragway. <laughs> All I can say is my back tires are almost bald. It is colder than balls out here. Is it not? Yeah. <laughs> I've actually got the wife over here. I don't know if, if she's in the camera view. <laughs> but uh, uh, I just I want to see if uh, we can improve on our times any. I'm not sure traction wise, but I do want to say this guys, uh, I've already got a line on some different back wheels and uh, some drag radials. So hopefully in the next couple weeks, um, we're actually going to be able to put some power to the ground, but tonight we're just going to, just going to try to have some fun. Yes, guys, I'm making excuses before I even get there. Uh, now, seriously though, um, what I'm going to try to do is, is hopefully let some big tire guys run before me they are doing bracket races tonight so i'm gonna let some of the big tire guys run and hope that you know they're kind of prepping the track tonight since they are doing brackets and uh maybe i can stick but uh if i try to if i try to hit the squeeze right out of the hole i, I already know i'm not going to stick on what's left of these street tires i have been abusing them but uh we'll see what happens guys i mean once again, I would just, I would really like to get a seven second pass in. Um, don't know if that's gonna happen, but we're gonna try like hell. I don't want just a seven second pass. I want like a mid seven. I, I mean, I, <laughs> I wanna get down there. Uh, I don't wanna blow my engine up to do it, but, but I would like to see like a seven five or a seven six. And I don't know if that'll happen tonight. Uh, it probably won't on these tires, but uh, it'd be cool as shit if it did, huh? <laughs> be a whole lot cooler if it did. All right, guys, day two. Uh, we went up there yesterday. <laughs> okay, so if you guys don't know, English Mountain, uh, it's like an hour from my house, guys. So we drove up there last night like idiots. Uh, I didn't. I didn't check the. Uh, I didn't check the Facebook page. They had closed the drag strip about an hour before we left to head up there. So I got about a mile away and Josh actually texts me and he's like, uh, bro, we closed like two hours ago. So anyway, uh, not going to let that stop me. I want to get some runs in. So it is Saturday now and I'm heading back up there. Guys, we are here. Um, go out here and talk to Bobby a minute and uh, we'll get down to business. GoPro Hero 5 has decided not to work today, so all I've got is this session, but the wifey is going to try to record some stuff from outside the car with her iPhone, so uh, we're going to make this first run in a, just to kind of baseline us. sitting there staring at my scanner trying to get it to work and, and I looked up and the light was green <laughs> yeah I, I, I was like not even watching I thought I was pre-staged so I looked down real quick to click the, the record button and then I looked up and it was dropping I said oh shit <laughs> Thank you, sir. All right, guys, our first run was another uh, 8.5 at 86.92. So right at 87 miles an hour. Shitty reaction time, of course, of a 
2.075 still better than I ever had in the truck <laughs> um, but like I was just telling him uh, like I fucked that all up guys and I didn't get any data so I'm gonna make one more NA pass real quick Yeah, that was like an eight seven. Uh, I just destroyed the tires. That right lane is slippery. I mean, it's fucking slick, guys. Yeah, that right lane sucks. I just, I just, I, I think I burned them off till like the three thirty or something. Uh, like an eight seven. Yeah, yeah, I did. Yeah, I destroyed those fucking tires. Dude, I'm almost afraid to use the nitrous tonight. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I've got it on a toggle. Yeah, I'm going to I'm gonna get back in that left lane. I had better luck over there. And, uh, yeah, well, I've, I've put a lot more timing in it. We can look at it and see. Yeah. Where, where lethal yeah. they just do like a like a box tune okay well my shit just made some kind of real weird noise did you hear it like after i done my burnout it sounded like something was winding down it's like I didn't hear that. yeah like after i stopped spinning the tires something in the back was going I was like what the fuck <laughs> yeah no shit all right, I'm going to go up here and probably let it chill for just a second. Huh? Uh, max is right around 26 degrees at the moment. Stock, I think it was like 18 or 20. Yeah. So I've got... Yeah, I've got quite a bit of time and in it, but uh, I had zero knock on that run, though, so... Yeah, I'm I, like I'm honestly I'm not even gonna pull any timing out before I run the hundred shot. I'm just gonna data log it and see what happens. If I if it starts flashing red danger to manifold at me, then I <laughs> I'm gonna go down here and park for a second. We are going to try the nitrous, but as you can tell on that last run, uh, I just destroyed the tires. I spun tires to half track, guys. So. Um, I'm gonna have to wait until I feel like it's hooked before I can actually bring the nitrous in. So I'm I'm not sure uh, what kind of improvement we're gonna see because probably only gonna have nitrous on the big end. All right, guys, let's hope she sticks. tires off out of the hole guys but uh that was only a hundred shot but it felt it oh, i felt it <laughs> oh that was nice interested in seeing what my mile an hour is going to be on that pass Boom! Hell yes! Hell yes! We got a 7.9, boys! We got a fuck. We're in the fucking sevens! First pass on the 100 shot, we're in the fucking sevens! Hell yeah! Doesn't seem like much, guys, but, uh... <laughs> It's been, it's been several years since I had a seven second car. Fucking out, fucking standing. 95 mile an hour. 
Hell yeah. We're in the fucking sevens, baby. <laughs> first pass on the bottle, we're in the sevens. Hell yes. All right, guys, so I got it so excited on that first nitrous run. Um, I forgot the data log. So I'm doing another another pass on the 100 shot and uh because i i need to know i need to know if i need to pull some timing i did not pull any timing on that first run from the na team creeping up I really do but uh the feeling you get when that 100 horsepower or whatever you've got it jetted for just smacks you in the ass and the tires breaks loose there ain't nothing like it man there is nothing like it I haven't even cracked the engine open guys uh you know it's just some bolt-ons and a 100 shot I'm running faster on that than I was in Steppenwolf you know cammed uh freaking 150 shot and you know perfectly tuned i still i still hadn't even finished tuning this guys i just haven't had time this week but hey guys so after looking at my data log my pcm was pulling about one degree up top so uh, one degree of time and so what i'm gonna do did that fire burn oh my god that sounds so good Um, so what I'm going to do guys is I'm going to everywhere it was pulling one degree I'm going to go ahead and pull two um, because I'm about to jet this thing up we're going to go up to I'll just do it a little at a time we'll go up to a, like say a 125 shot or something I couldn't find my fuel jet for the 125 shot so I just said fuck it and we've got it jetted for a 150 now so we're going to aim for some some mid sevens we're in the sevens i'm happy with that but uh i'd like to do a little more you may or may not be able to tell in the videos but every time i i you know kick the nitrous on it is uh breaking the tires loose so i don't know how much more i'm going to be able to throw at it tonight i uh, really need to get some drag radials uh that is coming guys but for now like I said earlier in the video, we're just here to have some fun. So uh, I've already hit my sevens for the night, so I'm happy about that. So we're just gonna run it a couple more times and see what happens. Good God. Wow. Yeah, that's getting it. Did you bring me some heads? I appreciate that, man. Like I said, I was having trouble finding a fuel jet for my 125 shot, so uh, we're just gonna go ahead and go up to the 150. Uh, problem, like I keep saying, is the tires. I don't know if the tires are gonna hold it, but I uh, guess we'll just have to find out. We've got this RX-7 next to us. He's actually the guy that busted our ass. If you go back and look at the video, Turbo C10 versus RX-7. This Turbo RX-7 over here uh, actually outran me in Steppenwolf several months back, so it's kind of funny. We're gonna run them in the Corvette now. Let's see what happens. tires off coming off the line and then when that 150 shot hit it just I don't know if you could tell from the video but it stepped sideways when the 150 hit I actually backed out of it for a second so probably not gonna be a great pass but oh that felt good though <laughs> 
I'm telling you guys, when 150 horsepower just kicks you in the ass all at once, it's just, oh, it's amazing. Yep, and spinning is not winning. Uh, I just went a 7.937, but uh, 97.5 mile per hour. So I picked up a couple mile per hour there, two mile per hour, but again, guys, just blowing the tires off. I'm gonna check my data log and try to run it again. Maybe try to do a little better burnout, but I, I think I'm at the limit of these street tires, especially them being bald. Um, yeah, what was my, what was my 60 foot? Oh yeah, my 60 foot was like a 203 uh, or almost 204. So yeah, guys, I'm just, uh, I'm just spinning. Did you catch that on video? Like the rear end just stepped out when that nitrous hit. I, it just blew, started blowing the tires off. I had to back out of it a little bit. Yeah. So I just ended up just running another seven nine. If I, I, I think I, I just need tires. Yeah. These tires are not going to hold that much nitrous. Yeah. I had, like I actually had to pedal a little bit about half track. Sweet though. But uh, fuck it. I'm going to try it again. Let me just check my dad log and then I'll run it one more time. I had zero uh, knock retard on that last run, guys, with the 150 shot. Um, that's with a total of, I think I was running a total of about 24 degrees of timing up top. So that's that's pretty awesome, guys. I'm not gonna have to change anything. Uh, it, it took every bit of that 150 shot. <laughs> of course, it took it all with the tires spinning, so. I actually had to pedal it a little bit. I'm, I'm still, I'm super excited, guys. I know I'm just some good tires away from mid sevens. We're gonna get that taken care of in the next week or two. Yeah, so what happened on that last run, guys, is I took off, it spun out of the hole a little bit. As soon as it grabbed, I kicked the nitrous back on, or I mean, I kicked the nitrous on, and the car went left a little, and I lifted, I only lifted about a quarter throttle, I guess, but that was enough. It shut the nitrous off, and then the car stepped back straight, and I laid into it, and the nitrous come on again. So that's why we only run a seven nine because I was I was pedaling the fucking car at half track. Um, God, man, yeah, I'm I'm at the I'm at the limit of these tires. I know good and damn well with some sticky tires, I, I'd be out here running mid sevens right now. Uh, maybe faster so we gotta get that taken care of but I'm gonna try to make one more pass on this 150 shot tonight um, I'm just at this point I'm just pissing in the wind on these tires but we're gonna try it we're gonna we're gonna give her the give her these nuts guys give her these nuts and give it the juice <laughs> seven nines tonight <laughs> fuck uh, fuck man time for some tires boys time for some tires shit we got another seven nine i'm just good i'm stuck there i'm on a fucking 150 shot and i'm stuck in the seven nines it's shit's pissing me off but i know it's because i'm just i'm spinning as soon as it comes in so hey we're in the fucking sevens anyway right Okay, so I'm just sitting here looking. I'm not picking up any mile an hour. Um, I don't know. It's like I'm... Now, I understand why my time isn't increasing because it's just destroying the freaking tires. But I'm not picking up any mile an hour either over the 100 shot on this 150 shot, which is really weird. Uh, I should be picking up quite a bit of mile an hour. So, uh, not quite sure what's going on here. It's acting like it's still got a freaking 100 shot in it. And it's really rich too. It's running, running really, really rich on the on the 150 shot. It's almost like it's not getting enough enough bottle, not getting enough nitrous. Now, I did have 
two degrees of knock retard on that run. So that's not good. Oh, okay, my I, my IATs, uh, my intake air temps, uh, they were pretty high at the start there, but then halfway through the run, you know, they dropped down. By the end of the run, they were back down to ambient temps. So, uh, see, right here is where the nitrous comes on. Yeah, and my AFRs drop all the way down to like a 10.52 when the nitrous comes on, guys. So that's, uh, we got to do something about that. Good news is we're not running out of fuel pump. Uh, bad news is our mile per hour is not increasing uh, with the increased nitrous shot. So, like I said, though, guys, I'm, I'm pretty happy with the 7.9. So I'm going to take that and call it a night probably shade tree hoonigan running his toyota down here again guys this is some backyard buffoonery right here he's got a uh, lexus v8 in it some spray broke his axle last time out the rear end See the flames coming out? Yeah. He, yeah, he was moving good. He was moving. I don't know if he almost had him, but he was moving good. Where'd he go? Uh, he went to wash your car for you? <laughs> oh, he was just like a test around the block. He'll yeah, he'll be right back. Yeah. <laughs> Make you feel good right now? He's got your money. He's got your money. What's up, bagging? Dude, you almost had them. <laughs> they started breaking up on the end, man. I heard it. I heard it and I saw the fireball. I was like, oh no. Did you get man. my bonus wings? Huh? Did you get my bonus wings? You went to Capital B, so I figured you would get my bonus wings. <laughs> yeah, I didn't play that bottom though. Yeah, yeah when, it's, when it's went to shift, I was like, I'm going to stay in it and see what it does. And then it was like, blah, 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 blah. I was like, okay. <laughs> yeah, it was shooting flames out the back. It doesn't like to shift, man. I got to light out of it and shift. I don't know why it does that. I think we need another gear. I think I need a new transmission. And that. I think it's flipped. Freaking Lexus V8. Yes, I don't have a bird now. This is as backyard as it gets, guys. I don't know what's going on, but for some reason, uh, it's going pig rich on the 150 shot, like down in the tens. Um, and it's not picking up any mile an hour. I don't know. It's acting like it's either getting too much fuel or not enough nitrous. But um, so what I'm gonna do is I actually jetted down the fuel jet a couple steps. So we're gonna try the 150 shot again. Honestly, it's probably pointless because what's gonna happen is if it does make more power, I mean, it's already spinning when the nitrous hits, so um, I'm sure it's just gonna get worse. <laughs> but, uh-oh, check engine light just came on. Let me see what that's all about. DTCs. System lean, bank one, system lean, bank two. That is not good. Status update, I am home. Uh, the issue with the check engine light is, uh, fuck, I don't know what it is, honestly. <laughs> no, I was uh, I was getting ready for that last run. I had jetted the, the fuel jet down a little bit because it was going so rich on the 150 shot, and uh, which, honestly, guys, it would have been pointless anyway. I mean, it was, what's going on is as soon as that 150 shot hits, uh, it's, you know, it's just ice skating down the rest of the track. I mean, it's like freaking, <laughs> I'm having to drive the shit out of the car uh, from the time that hits is basically what I'm saying, which honestly is kind of cool. <laughs> I like having to actually drive the car instead of just being along for the ride, but, uh, but it's not good for uh, our times, obviously. Uh, I am gonna get some drag radials in the next week or two. I've actually already found the wheels I'm gonna order, and yes, they're eBay wheels. <laughs> So uh, I'm getting some 17 by 9.5s for the back and uh, just because the drag radials are way cheaper in 17 inch than they are in 18 inch. So 
I'm gonna get the 17 inch wheels to put on the back just when we're racing and I'm getting some 275, 40, 17, uh, probably Mickey Thompson ET Street R's. So uh, hopefully that's gonna help us out because right now I feel like I'm at a power level where I should be running mid sevens. Uh, just the way the car sits now, if I just had some good tires, I feel like it should be mid sevens. But uh, back to the check engine light, uh, it popped, uh, I was sitting there getting ready to make one more run and all of a sudden it popped up a code saying lean on bank one and two. I just got home, haven't had time to really look into it, but it maintained that code all the way home. And what I mean by that is I reset it several times. It kept coming back. So um, the uh, the wide band is, you know, the wide band says it's, it's running fine, guys. I mean, there's nothing wrong with the wide band. So I don't know if, if maybe being so rich, it has... Uh, I, I don't think clogged is the word for it, but possibly it's it's done something to my narrow bands uh, because it was running so rich on that 150 shot. It was dipping down into the low tens AFRs, so I don't know. I'm gonna have to check that out. If I have to, I'll replace my narrow band uh, O2 sensors. And uh, I shit, I've got several sets sitting around here, guys. It's not like I don't work on this shit all the time. But anyway, I'm I'm really happy, guys. Really excited. Uh, I'm finally tickling the sevens. And I know good and well with a set of drag radials, I should be able to bring that down to at least a, a 7.7, seven, 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 maybe even lower. We will find out in the next couple weeks. Six tenths, guys. Six tenths of a second we dropped just from the 100 shot. That's freaking awesome. I, I mean, we did our baseline run, 8.05. Um, on the 100 shot and again it did spin the tires if you watch if you listen to the video real close you can hear right when i hit the 100 shot because the engine changes tone and you can hear the tires going <laughs> yeah i'm making sound effects guys but we dropped over a half a second just on the 100 shot uh and breaking the tires loose at the same time so yeah I, i've got no doubt guys with some good tires this thing's gonna freaking rock and although I have to kind of focus on some other stuff I've got going on, like this Camaro that's sitting here, and, uh, you know, <laughs> we've got to get the 6.0 back together for Ray. I mean, it's that time of year now. I told Ray I would do the Nova swap over the winter, so we're going to have to start kind of focusing on that. But the next step for the China Vet is going to be an eBay converter, uh, probably something in the 3,000 to 3,400 RPM stall range. I honestly feel like I can drop another two to three tenths uh just with a good converter and then the tires on top of that guys we're i think we're going to be tickling uh low sevens or high sixes just with the converter and the tires and uh you know i can still jet that that nitrous kit up another 25 horsepower if i switch over to the uh, nx kit i think i can do 200 on the nx kit so uh, I think I said it a few videos back, guys, but we may actually hit our goal before we even have to open this engine up, which would be freaking awesome because as soon as we hit our 10 second or high six second in the eighth goal with the uh, with the eBay build, I'm going to start getting a little more serious with this car. Um, <laughs> I know a lot of you are like, yeah, you bought a Corvette, you know, freaking midlife crisis, but... Here's the thing, guys. Uh, I've, I've said it before. I'll say it again. It's not a Corvette to me. It's a 3,200-pound car with an LS in it, and my goal is to make it fast. And I don't mean 10-second fast. I mean, once we're done with the eBay build, we're going to get more serious with this thing, and, uh, well, you'll just have to see. Anyway, guys, I want to thank you again for watching. If you like this video, make sure you give it a thumbs up. Uh, make sure you share it if you know anybody else that might want to see it. Thanks for watching, but the video's over now, so get out in the garage, get something done, and I'll see you guys next time here on Bad Luck Garage.